Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how I achieved this Vols inspired look. So I've already primed and moisturized my face. I'm just going to list all those products that I use in the description box. I'm going in with my NYX Yellow in the shade STFU and taking my Anastasia blending brush and I'm using this as my transition color. Also this is going to help bring out the orange I'll be I'm taking this soft pinkish orange color in the shade LOL from NYX and I'm going to be focusing this shade in my crease, slowly working it up to the yellow. And I'm going to be using my Real Techniques blending brush. Then I'm going back in with my Anastasia blending brush, making sure that there's no harsh line between the two colors. There's going to be a lot of blending, you guys, for this look. Now I'm going in my Modern Renaissance palette with my blending brush, and I'm taking the shade Red Orchid in Real Gar. And we're just going to darken the outer corners just a little bit just to add some definition. Now I'll be going in my Sephora Hologram Palette. I'm going to be taking an orange gold color in the shade Castanet to apply on my lids with a flat eyeshadow brush. Now I'm going to do a wing liner with my NYX Black Matte Liquid Liner.
Now I'll be going in with my NYX White Matte Liquid Liner and I'm going to apply this on the top of the black liner. Now guys, it's okay if you make any mistakes, just go back in with the black liner and correct any mistakes that you have made. And honestly, you guys, I really didn't like the white liner. It started to crack throughout the day, so I do need to try a different one. Now I'm going in my glow kit, and I'm going to take the shade Mimosa in Crushed Pearl to highlight up under my brow bone. Now I'll be applying my favorite lashes from Ardell and these are the Demi Wispies and I'm going to be using the Duo Glue. I also love the Vegas lashes as well, those are my favorite. So now I'm going to put a coat of the Stila Huge Extreme Lashes. You guys, honestly this mascara is my favorite. It's way better than the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. All time favorite, you guys all need to try it. I went and picked up this product when um, when Ulta had their 21 day beauty and I got this for $11 and honestly I do not regret it. It's awesome. Now I'm just going in with my NYX liquid liner and I'm just going to correct anything that was shown from the glue from the lashes. And now I'm just going in with my NYX Black Eyeliner and placing this in my waterline. Alright, for foundation, I'll be using my favorite True Match in the shade W6 Sun Beige. And I'm going to be using my NYX Dewy Finishing Spray and my Real Techniques Foundation Brush. You guys, I will be trying more foundations. I hate when I get stuck on one. So definitely comment down below if you have your favorite foundation so I could definitely try that out. From drugstore to name brand, whatever it is, comment down below so I can try that out. Also you guys, I will be doing a Rihanna Finney product review, but my shade is still out of stock. So once that comes in, I'll be doing that video for you guys. Now I'm going in with my Fit Me Concealer in the shade 20 Sand Sable and I'm just going to highlight those areas up under my eye, down the bridge of my nose, the top lip, my chin, and up under my cheekbone. Now I'm going in with my CoverGirl in the shade 105 to set those concealed areas. Then I'm going to be taking my NYX No Filter in the shade Classic Tan and I'm going to set the areas that I did not bake, which will be my cheekbone, my forehead, my neck, and then I'll begin brushing away all the powder that I've baked with. And you guys, I did have a little runny nose, so that's just powder in my nose, that's not a booger. It's just powder, y'all.
Now I'm going in with my NYX No Filter in the shade Deep Golden with my angled brush and I'm just going to be contouring now. I definitely didn't want a harsh contour. I like this powder a lot just because it gives me a more golden but still more of a soft contour. To highlight, I'm going to be taking my glow kit in the shade Mimosa and Starburst with my Real Technique fan brush. Then I'm going to be taking a small smudge brush and I'm going to take the shade It Crowd and I'm going to apply this up under my waterline. Then I'll be going in with my Sephora Hologram Palette. I'm going to be taking the shade Castanet and I'm going to just highlight in my inner corner. Then I'm just going to be applying mascara on my lower lashes. For my lips, I'll be using the cream lipstick that I use for my lid. And honestly, you guys, this color turned out way too bright and I was not expecting that. So I'm going to darken it up a little bit with my NYX lip liner in the shade Current 830. Then I'm going to blend that out with my fingers. You guys, I am so in love with NYX products, you guys. And this is how I achieved the Vols inspired look. I want all my Vol fans to try it out and tag me on Instagram at embraceyourface underscore underscore and tell me how it turns out. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, comment down below, and give it a thumbs up. All the products will be listed down in the description box and I'll see you guys later.